Hi, um, we're in New Mexico. It is bucketing rain. I guess it's monsoon season. Um, These red cliffs are so cool. It is beautiful out here. And we see blue skies ahead, so I think uh, things are clear enough. Yeah, almost to our destination. Um, so in the Yelp review, I saw someone talking about crab enchiladas. That's what I'm having. I'm super excited about it. Cool. What are you having for dinner? Chili rellenos. Stuff with cheese. And that's my favorite. I love that stuff. Have you been to New Mexico before? Probably just driving through. Not, not anything substantial. Yeah, oh, yeah, this is my first time too, so pretty excited about that. Me too. Um, we got parked here in the dirt lot across from the casino for the night, um, and it's super hot, so we're gonna go for a swim. So, Ray, you definitely... We probably came um, six or seven miles north of Pecos, and then we saw a National Forest uh, picnic area sign, so that's where we turned off um, at Highway 63. And there's a bunch of little rocky beach spots all along this little area. I think she got the lens. I don't want to do this. You always want to get in water. But it's really, really cold. It is definitely not colder than Oregon rivers. Then you get in. No. <laughs> All right. Oh, you're going blind, huh? Well, I don't think I should lose those. Oh God, I don't want to do this. Is it right here? Yep. I thought the camera was going in with you. Are you okay? <laughs> I didn't jump. I didn't jump out far enough. I landed on my tailbone. Oh, oh. babe. Oh, that hurt. Yeah. I should actually film you getting in the water. Okay. How about a cannonball? It's really deep. I could totally do it. Yeah. Where was it up to here? On you? Yeah. Cannonball from where? <laughs> from shore. You wouldn't make it. I would make it. I landed on my tailbone. Oh. oh. Babe. Oh, that hurt. Yeah, oh. I am sorry and sad for you. <laughs> but listen, it's not that bad, and I want to get in again. Okay. Oh, this is wonderful. Oh, let's go. That's moving fast. The that funny is thing is that you are not that far offshore and nope. it just gets so deep.
This is the Dale Ball Trail System. Find anything good? Yeah, there is just all this quartz, I think. Quartz up here that is just really beautiful. <laughs> I mean, it's just everywhere. Here, show them. Yeah, there is a bunch of little ones right there. Just everywhere. Yeah. Really pretty. Maybe not. Very pretty. It is just beautiful out and it's raining. It's just this one big cloud overhead. But, uh, pretty random. yeah, you can see the ground's getting wet. It's just that big guy up there. Beautiful evening. We are heading out for dinner and drinks. Jackalope IPA from Chama River Brewing Co. And Brad is having elevated IPA, elevated IPA from La Cumbre, both out of Albuquerque. Coming to you from Camel Rock Casino in sunny Santa Fe, New Mexico. If it's not obvious already, we are huge beer lovers. This is true, and we found a couple that we really love. Um, my favorite at the moment is this Almanac IPA from Tractor Brewing Company in Albuquerque. And my favorite is the Happy Camper IPA from the Santa Fe Brewing Company. We're at this incredible boondocking spot and we've been here for a few days living for free, which is hard to beat. In any case... Um, in any case, this is our last night in Santa Fe. We will miss you, Santa Fe. Yeah, no, it's been really fun. Um, we actually met some people, we met a couple through Instagram who was also here. Um, it's a wonderful RV life. Check them out. Yeah, Rachel and Chris. It was so great to meet you guys. So that was really, really fun. I feel like the Instagram community is so supportive and it's been a really great way to see all the other young people out there doing what we're doing. We had no idea. Um, it's really impressive and inspiring and we hope that if this is a goal of yours that jump on Instagram and just search for these people living out of their RVs, their vans, their buses. I mean, you'll see that it can be done. And so not, many people are doing it. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, as always, thanks for following along. Cheers. Cheers.